Seegers was 0 for 4 on Friday night. May have got him with the breaking ball there. Molina did. Struck him out looking. It's only pitched 12 and a third innings coming in. That ball by Harrelson on the ground right back up the middle. The Red Raiders have their second hit of the inning. Runners will be going. There they go. Swing and a miss. May have foul tipped it back to Maxey, but fooled on the pitch from Molina. Dillon hits that one on a line into the gap in right center field, gets down, hopped over the wall. It hopped over the wall and unable to score from first is Owen Washburn. He would have. Carter might have even tried to leg out a triple. Ground ball in the infield, scooped up out at short, but no play at home. Seeger's able to get it, looked at Cade Moss, decided no opportunity to get Washburn, and throws to first base to get Hudson White, but the Red Raiders have tied the ball game on that ground ball. Got him. Got him looking on the breaking ball from Brandon Beckel. Beckel in a pretty decent lead there by Honar. Ground ball towards third, knocked down by Bazell. Has to get up, make the throw, stretch by Cash, and the inning is over. Gage Harrelson, ground ball. Third baseman Tello was in a little bit. That ball got past him out into left field. As the shortstop Seegers could not get over, and the Red Raiders have a one-out base hit from Harrelson, his second single today. Oh, that pitch way past Cade Moss, way outside from Brecht. Kind of looked at his hand and shook it around, but balls of strikes. Runner goes, pitches outside, Moss's throw to third base, not in time. Just in under the tag is Gage Harrelson. Off the plate, Washburn does not chase it. Ball thrown back to the mound. Coming home from third is Gage Harrelson. How about that play? But in a two to one ball game, very important. That ball grounded back out towards the mound. Beckel is off the mound to get it. Throws wide over at first, but Cash able to make the play, keep his foot on the bag. And the young guy out of Keller playing in his 71st game. Lifts that ball out into center field. Line drive gets down for a base hit. And the Red Raiders have a two-out base runner here in the seventh inning. Number one in the country two weeks ago today. Tracer Lopez takes the first pitch. He sees rips it into the gap in right center field. He's got at least a double. May go for three. Red Raiders are going to score a couple of runs. It was Hudson White first, followed by Hester. And the young guy, Tracer Lopez, has hit it into the open spot in that shift in the outfield. Red Raiders have a triple and now a 4-1 lead. Volker until now. Hits that ball really well, way out into right center field. And the Red Raiders have an insurance run. Home run, Gavin Cash. It's his fifth of the year. Been very good. Here's Dylan Maxey lifts that one out into left center field. They're going to give chase, and it's not going to be caught. Dylan Maxey was 0 for 3 before that pitch, and now has the Red Raiders' second home run here in the bottom of the eighth inning. And for Dylan Maxey, that is his first as a Red Raider on Sunday at 1 o'clock. That ball's hit into the gap out in right center field. It's going to get down. Mosley can't get there. Long run for Huxdorf. Red Raiders are going to get two more runs right here on the double by Nolan Hester. Throw home is offline, and the Red Raiders have four runs here in the bottom of the eighth inning. Do it again at two and two. Ground ball down towards first. It's a fair ball. Cash basically <laughs> makes the pickup of the ground ball and kneels on first base and the ball game is over. The Red Raiders win it today over Iowa. Take this series, 8-3 uh, final for the Red Raiders.